I've got Scooby out and he's come in for our two weekend house training. Uh, his first day was a little rough, you know, we thought he might be a little bit of separation anxiety, but as you can see, he's come around a little bit, you know. Um, personality difference today is 100%. I love this personality. A little nervous yesterday, but he would come up to the gate to me, so um, I think he's already starting to kind of figure out that I'm the person that he wants to kind of be with. But um, love his name, love his personality. He's not real sure about these treats. He's like, I don't know if I want that or not. I tried. You spit it out. Here, if I make it even. Oh, okay. All right. So, not sure about the treats, but we'll get there, I'm sure. Okay. Let's see what Mr. Scooby knows on day one. Come on. Huh? Oh, bounce, bounce, huh? Scooby, sit. Good. No. Good. Kind of no, but a definite sit there. Not terrible. At least he knows what a leash is and how to walk on it. Oh. No. But he does have a little bit of a bounce to him, you know, a little bit of a, a jump. And I'm not a big fan of that. He's just too big of a pup to be doing that. So, um, overall, I think he'll do just fine. Huh. We just need to start getting some directions in there, telling him what we, what's expected of him and what we want him to do. Hey, you can check that one. So, sit. Well, we're going to put him up and train for a week. No. Sit. Good. And we'll get him back out at the end of week one and see how much he's made, what, how much um, improvement he's made in the first week. Yeah, I've got Scooby out and he's been here for a week, so I wanted to put a little bit on tape, show you where he's at. He's doing really good, you know. Um, you were kind of worried about a little bit of separation anxiety. And some of what I see is just clingy dog behavior. I'm not sure... Um, you know, it, it might be a little more severe when you're at your own home, but out here he just seems to be one of these dogs that doesn't like to get away from you. Um, you know, and there's nothing wrong with that. I mean, we love him just the same, um, you know, as, as far as that goes. We just got to figure out some of those quirks to make it a little easier to live with a dog like that. But overall, he's doing really good. He is picking up the obedience part. Um, I do agree he's had some of this before. You know, but I don't know if they just missed a few sections here and there. You know, I always say there's some gaps in the training. Um, and that may just be the way I train compared to somebody else trains or something like that. But where I expect a dog to be and what I expect him to understand, I think he's missing a few things. So um, we're going to kind of try to help put those into place. All right, Mr. Scoob. You ready? Okay, let's go. Good sit. Stay. Stay means just that. Don't move until I tell you to move. And even though he's at week one, I feel comfortable getting out here and talking. As I said, I think he's had a little bit of this. I've had very few corrections on stay. Good boy, okay. He doesn't always do treats. He does sometimes, but sometimes he doesn't. See it. All right, let's go. Been leaving my hand hanging down because I can't get him to do the little play biting on my back of my arm, but he has to grab my hand a couple times. So I really leave my hand hanging down to kind of make sure that we're getting that no bite. That's not okay. Good. Hey, stay. Good boy, okay. It's got to wait for that okay, wait for that release. Come on. Come on. Good. It's got what I call a sneak attack. He likes to get up behind you and kind of sneak up on you. And that may be where he's getting the playfulness in the back 
biting the back of the arms. So I'm not allowing it. He's got to stay up with me. Let's go. Come on. Hurry. Good. Come on. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Good. We've tried playing some get it comes. Sometimes they work. Sometimes they don't. So we're going to try one first. A lot of times he won't go get the treat. Like I said, he doesn't like to move away from you sometimes. All right. Let's see. Ready, ready, ready. Come on. Ready, 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 ready. Get it. Yeah. He doesn't want to move away, and that's okay. So I just started back up comes the last few days. So I think this is going to work a lot nicer. Hey, ready? Come. Sit. That I don't like. And that's Dane behavior. As I said, I thought he had some Dane in him. That leaning on you and getting right up next to you, that's kind of a Dane thing. Um, they're all kind of like that. They're they're gentle giants, but they're just big dogs and they're kind of clumsy. Come, sit, no. Come, sit, no. Come, sit, good. And so as I said, being a little needy, being right up on you, I'm gonna kind of correct some of those behaviors because they're not always conducive to being in the house. Hey, come, hurry, no. Good, come, sit. Good, back, back, good, that's a good sit, good boy. I don't like him being behind me, come on, hurry, 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 come on. Scooby, come, sit, come, that's not come, 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 this way. Use my feet to kind of guide him where I want him, there you go, good boy. You don't want him going off to the side come is right here and the reason it's right here is because if they get side to side then they run past you and they get they play this get keep away game sit good so in week two i'm going to work some in our play yards where i can get away from him and move away and then call him from there and then we're going to try a little bit more movement away he's doing pretty good stays so i may be able to do comes at the end to stay I just don't like confusing dogs that don't know what a release command is. But so far, he's doing really well with stay. So, no. Off. Good. No. So, when he leans into me, I correct it. Good. <laughs> uh, Labs and Danes are both very big leaners. So, you know, we don't know what his history is or exactly his DNA. But I think he's got something in there that had some of those qualities in it. And it's just some of that that I'm correcting. I thought I felt teeth there for a second. No. Good. But overall, he's doing well. You know, he's making good progress. You're sitting on my foot again, dude. Off. Come on. Good. He's got a good personality. I love his personality. Um, you know, and he, he hears any chain rattle um, down the hallway and he thinks it's time to go train it. Oh my gosh, he gets so excited. So I think consistency is going to be key with him. Um, you know, maybe some socialization, that sort of thing. But overall, he is doing very well. So we're going to put him up and we'll get him back out at the end of week two and see how he's doing then.